It is just a little bit after nine o'clock on your Thursday, and if you joined us on the show this morning, or if you saw on social media, you may have seen that we are going to be doing a Christmas craft. So I have my elves with me, doing all of the hard work right now as right. we prep yes. to do our Christmas craft. If you're looking to lose a finger, try this craft. <laughs> okay, so let Give me, me show injuries. you. Yeah. <laughs> all right, that is enough, you two. Let me show you. the dullest knife ever. What the plan is? This. What was I going to do? Bring a super shiny. This is what we're going to try to make. Do you see these cute little reindeer? They can be they can be ornaments. They can be tied onto presents. So we're going to go ahead and give this a shot. You'll notice while the boys are cutting up um, all the things that we need, I'll tell you what you actually have to get. A glue gun. These little pom-pom things. Dollar store. Some pipe cleaners. Dollar store. I got some ribbon that says Merry Christmas. And then... Um, some people use little pins to do the eyes. I found little googly eyes, so I thought maybe we'll use these. And if you didn't want to use those, <clears> I figured you could use a Sharpie and make eyes. Because truth be told, I couldn't find the pins. Okay, now let's actually tell the real story. <laughs> Katie likes to drink wine. <laughs> <laughs> this so all is last corks, weekend, right? right? Yeah. <laughs> so knowing that we needed nine wine corks, last night I had put them out. <laughs> right. No, if you need help, of course, there are resources. But um, Katie... Yes. Saved all of these corks. Well, I have one of those boots that you put. It's well, mine's a boot. Uh, they're all different shapes. And anytime you have a wine cork, you put it in there. So I just took a bunch out of there. So I there's think... still hundreds left, right? <laughs> <laughs> I'm worried. Uh, yeah. If anybody at home probably has some extra wine corks, there you go. So um, chime in at any point too. Let us know what people are saying. Let us know who's joining us. Elaine says Merry Christmas. Thanks, Elaine. Elaine. Merry Christmas. Okay, so let's talk about what we've been doing here. Okay. First of all, this is something that you can actually that we found on what our website, yeah. Simplemost. Yeah. Okay, so you know on our Facebook page there are all those sometimes weird, wacky, bizarre posts. They come from this other service called Simplemost. Um, <clears throat> so this is really something that you could do with your family and that's kind of like their whole mission, their goal. Yeah. Uh, so what we've done so far is, um, we took two, two whole corks and we cut one. Ah. <laughs> good. We cut one here. So this is one third of the cork and two thirds of the cork. You need this. Then we took another cork and cut it kind of the long way. So consider this was the cork. That's what Aaron's right. doing right now. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> cut it in half and then quartered it. So we've got four pieces now. These are gonna be the legs. And then um, this is gonna be like the neck and body, I believe. Uh, or neck and head yes. for the reindeer. So while Aaron continues to cut a cork, would you like to start to do the next steps here? Sure. So <clears throat> you want to get to the hot glue gun maybe and I can read you the things that you're going to do? Yes. So what you're going to do is, okay, these are the legs like we talked about. So you need the leg and then let's pick you a good body. What do you like for the body, this one? I don't know, tall, dark, and handsome. Oh <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, anyways, how about this one? Someone with a nice figure. Yeah, there you go, that's perfect. <laughs> Uh, how about this one for the body? Looks great. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna um, put that's gonna be the body, and then this is gonna be the legs for it. So, <laughs> you like that, huh? Yeah, I did. I did. So set your body like so we could show people. And yeah, 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 exactly. So you're gonna want to glue those on. And now this, these are a little bit shorter, so maybe just well, welcome to my life. Right. Just pay attention to that as you glue them on. Okay. So, so just glue be careful with what? the hot glue. Gun. Um, glue so the tops of this exactly, to the body? You're going to glue, yeah, okay. and you can even close these a, a little closer, and you're going to glue them like this, right? So that's going to be your body. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, Okay. Great. Okay, let's see if this works. Everyone's really quiet. Yes. Well, it's looking great. I'm really concentrating. You know, the worst part about hot glue is that you actually have to do it really, really fast. Okay. Oh, Dan wants to know how Katie deals with you guys. <laughs> That's a great That's question, Dan. Oh, yes. That's why she's got so many wine corks. Right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, okay, here's one. Now, I have a question. Is the goal to make these actually stand? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Huh. Okay, well, we're working hard toward that goal. Yeah, no, I'm sure it'll stand. It's going to look adorable. I would get, for my suggestion, when you're doing these, cutting these in half, definitely get a sharp like knife. This would be an adult doing this because uh, this this one is like a nail file that Katie brought in. This one's a little bit better. So following the instructions, it just takes, uh, you gotta be careful with this. And then I'm cutting these in half. Okay. No, um, you could do one, yeah, you could do one more if you want. Yeah. Okay. We need another glue stick. Don't worry, I've got it right here. Get it right into the back here. And then you, can push, you gotta push this a little bit. There's another finger. Oh yeah, keep going. Is it going? Okay. Okay. 
There careful, you go. Careful, careful, careful. Okay, I think we loaded it up with hot glue. Okay, good. Okay. In the meantime, I'm figuring out how to do all of the antlers. Oh, MB recommends okay. putting it on the body instead of the legs, the glue. Oh. oh. <laughs> Shoot. Mm. Well, next time, next Happy time, birthday, we've got more MB. to do. Is it my mom? Yeah. <laughs> you know, also <laughs> here's the other thing about hot glue is that you just get these like yeah. spider webs everywhere. Yeah. Okay, so now you need your neck and your head. So what it's going to look like is the little neck is going to be like here, okay? That's its neck. Yeah. And then the head is going to go like that. Okay? Yeah. All right. I'm going to take MB's advice. Mm -hmm. Body first, right? Okay. And then the head goes where? And then so the head is going to go like this, okay. right? Okay. So kind of like half on, half yeah, off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you know, well, whatever, whatever you think looks best. With my life. Maybe, on. maybe, maybe all the way on. Yeah. This is what it looks like. Well, what does the picture look like? Like this. See? Uh, yeah. Oh, it needs a little tail too. That's coming. That's definitely. <laughs> That's step like 19. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so what do you think? Oh, that's a little... That's a good start. It looks good so far. It's our first one. Okay, so next you get to add the details. Now listen, I got a couple different color, different sizes of palms. Mm -hmm. So you can pick your Rudolph's nose, which size you'd like. This works. Rudolph's nose. And then, do you want to do eyes with a Sharpie, or do you want to do googly eyes? Oh, no, eyes? googly eyes okay. all the way. Hello. Hi, baby. What do you think? We take the easy way out? <laughs> Again, dollar store. Dollar tree, I guess you said. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> so. The, the most costly part of this project would be the wine. The wine. <laughs> but yes, you can the probably wine. buy the yes. horse. Okay, who's counting? That? Right. <laughs> oh, Dan wants to know what the tail is made out of. Yeah, me too, actually. Yeah. Well, we're about to find out. You want blue googly eyes? Um, is that good? Yes. Okay. Oh, I like okay, it. You're okay. going to have to get those out there. There's little ones and then there's medium ones. Well, we're gonna. Find I like that here. these all um, kind of resemble real eyes. Like, all sometimes you only see black googly eyes. Okay. Oh, you use a wide variety of colors. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Um, also for the antlers. So we have three, so we can all make really our own. Think. So this will work. I think we go. Okay, so now what do I do, Katie? You could glue the eyes on. I'll make. You want me to make your antlers? Um, Just sure. To speed up this process okay, a little. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, anyone have Christmas plans? What are you guys doing for Christmas for uh, New Year's? Let us know. Um, it, maybe we'll take along. <laughs> to make the antlers, by the way. So here's what I'm doing. I'm taking two little pieces of the pipe cleaner. And then I'm going to wrap this pipe cleaner <clears throat> around this one. And then you make its little antlers like this, which are going to get put right into the reindeer. So that Has anyone to, gone deer hunting oh, yet? Like this. Okay. Did you put your eyeballs no, on? No, I don't know how to do oh, this. Just glue them on. And I think. So these, these are what they did oh, for. Oh, back. Yeah, so maybe like right around here. Okay. And snowmobile trails will be opening. I don't think there, there's not enough snow, but they'll be opening oh, soon. Yeah. When uh, I think today was. Has anyone today. ever made these wine cork reindeers before? Because I, I think they're oh, pretty crap. popular. Mine's crying. It's got like a teardrop. Eddie's hogging the glue gun. Sorry. Aaron, do you want to switch with me? No, no. I'm now, go. typically, by the way, they sometimes the um, pipe cleaners, they do brown ones if you want it to be like really realistic. I picked up the red ones because this was what I could find. So its tail's gonna be red. Too. So Katie has the funniest story about finding all of this stuff. <laughs> it was a real, it was like traumatic. Yeah. I found all traumatic of it in one her, store. Yeah, However, it was much yeah. too expensive for me to purchase <clears throat> because I tend to be very frugal. Yeah, that's so fine. I was like, no, I'm not buying it. It was a big art kit. But what am I gonna do with the big art kit once we're done? We only needed a couple things. So, oh, you can pick your nose and glue your nose on one of those. And um, so that's nose. why I made Paul go to. <laughs> Four different stores. You know what they say. What do they say? You can pick your friends, you can pick your nose, but you can't pick your friend's nose. It's true. Can you pick all I the glue that, that you get off the set? <laughs> off of it? <laughs> oh, that looks so good. Well, very well. Good job, Ed. Good job, Thanks. big guy. Okay, so then your antlers are going to be right here. Do we glue them in or do we well, stick them in? Well, you could try either. It, this says to glue them in, but... I think glue's probably your best bet. You think so? Yeah, okay, big guy, you go. Oh, all right. And yeah. then this is going to be Literally. your little tail. So your mom and said nice. put it on here first, right? Uh, yeah, that's what she said. And then she said put the feet on top of it. Can I try to? Yeah, go. Is it easy to stick in, or? Yeah, it's not too bad. Okay, so maybe we'll try sticking. I it have a feeling it'll fall off eventually. Mm -hmm. You know, so that maybe if you're giving it as a gift, you would. Now this could be a. Um, you could put this on with a present. Or like a little a little Christmas tree. Oh. Yeah. 
You're getting a lot of fans, Eddie? Mm -hmm. Right, man. <laughs> yeah, I think, I think maybe I made this a little large. <laughs> um, so we were out by the Outer Harbor a couple of weekends ago, and um, <clears throat> you know how right by that state park that's down there, the new state park, uh, they have that little grassy knoll right by the parking lot when you drive in. <laughs> Cute. Yeah. yeah. Well, anyway, there was this herd of deer. Is that what you call them? Is that what it's? Yeah. Okay. So the deer we're just grazing there. It was like, <laughs> it was pitch black. So, oh, this is not gonna be good. Just a slow, yeah, just. So they were really enjoying their meal. But what was really, really cool was that there was this male deer. I don't, I don't think a I- A buck? A buck, thank you. I've never seen one before. And it had- Really? Yeah. It was like the coolest with experience. The, with the racket, I'm gonna cut another. It had a, a rack huge, of antlers? Yes, so it was like this. That's yeah. six Did you, point, Is that right? what you made right here? Yeah. <laughs> it was, I mean, this guy made a replica. Oh. This was huge. Okay. Now, truth be told, I thought that this ribbon was uh, actual material, but it is not. Mm. So, in that case, I think we're going to have to be a little. It said Merry Christmas, so I thought that was so cute. So, I wonder if instead of making, typically you're supposed to make a bow, but since this isn't colored on both sides, I wonder if maybe instead of that, we Can you make just... a bow, Katie? Oh well, you could, but I wonder <clears throat> if instead, since it's white on the other side, we should just do it like that. Do you know what I'm saying? Hmm. And that way it would just stay. Yeah, that's a good idea. Stuck. Okay. So we'll just do it like this. But typically you're supposed to make a little bow, but instead we're just going to wrap it around like that. Okay, so this is adorable. So I just need one little, a little bit of glue for you. Yours came out very well. What'd you say? Oh, uh, look at yours. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I put the eyes on the wrong spot. <laughs> That's throwing me for a little. How many corks does this take? Three corks per tiny deer. Three corks. Three. Okay. So remember, so let's just, I'll recap really quick. So it's this one cork, so it was all together like this. So we cut it into two thirds and one third. You've got one cork now for the body, full cork. And then we've got the legs here, which was another cork. So that's three all together. Ta-da! And is this the final product? That's it. How, How easy. Do you, what do you think? Right? Oh, came yours out came out super well, yeah. Yeah. That's great. So this could go on like a, a present. I think you could put it as an ornament on yeah. a tree or oh, something. Oh, totally. You could make it an ornament, put something <clears> on it. You could like put Ed's name right here and then put it on his present. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like use it as your present tag. So it came out really uh, cute. So, gonna nice. now, um, I know, mine's a little special. That's and quite the, uh, <laughs> I think it's quite the deer. It's, it's a nice one. Yeah, it's, it's now, nice. so maybe... You know what? <laughs> a little crazy. Is... He's caught into the... He was trying to help you with your wine, I think. <laughs> so, <laughs> right, exactly. That's so funny. Okay, let's see here. We'll set them right next to each other, right yeah. in front of you, Meg. Hey. So there you go. That's adorable. Ta-da! All right. That wine was... cork reindeer. That was a good job, Katie. Thank yeah, you. That was very, well, um, very creative. At Easter, remember I made you guys do the tie dye Easter eggs. Yeah, that yeah, was really fun. Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. I think this is a really great time for people like to kind of come together as a family and try and do something that's really um, creative. Get yeah, off the video games for a few yeah, minutes. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Spend yeah. some time around the kitchen yeah. table. Put down some like pads over the kitchen table because I know in my house. My, I've got like a wooden table, mm -hmm. and my mother would have a fig. Yeah, yes. yeah. I actually He's once so uh, tried to iron something on my kitchen table. Oh my yeah. Goodness. So there's a terrible heat stain as a result. Well, your first mistake is <clears throat> trying to iron. Right. Well, so we do, do if the kids do homework on the table, Sharon's always like, get a surface. Exactly. Because, yeah. So oh. I would recommend that. There That's you what go. you'll be saying one day. Oh, yeah, you get think so? <laughs> yes. Yes. Uh. But hey, uh, let us know what. Um, what your plans are for Christmas. We'd love to hear from you also. Um, you know, this is like, this is a really important time of the season, I think, to kind of reflect in. Oh, so you kept yours nice and close. I don't know, be with your family and see so. what's right. so happened I, over the last year or what you're like, grateful for. Once you do this once or twice, I think it's you important to do yes. this. Once you do it once or twice, <clears throat> we think that you get a, an idea of like. Better hang of it. Yeah, a little bit of a better hang of it. So maybe we should have. Done that, but I, you know what? No, Everybody saw us. Yeah. Every reindeer is different. <laughs> yeah, they sure are. They <laughs> came out well. Well, good luck yeah. on your reindeer. Have a nice holiday. We'll be back yeah. tomorrow. Yeah. Um, Katie's off. Katie's I off until what? I'm off until next week because I am making pierogi um, with my family on Saturday, but tomorrow we have to do all the fillings. Oh, it's prep day? It is prep day because if you don't do that ahead of time, then oof. 
And they're quite a labor, labor yeah. intensive. Very labor, labor intensive. Yeah. They are. They're delicious, yeah. by the way. Yeah. Well, Thanks. play your cards right. <laughs> yeah. your cards right, right bring them in. We'd love to taste yeah. them. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, have a great, great holiday season. Whoops. I knocked this little oh. over. And um, we'll put up the um, finished products. instructions and the finished products, too. Merry Christmas. Day. Bye bye.